This is Tomahawk, and welcome back, everybody, to another episode of Abstraction Mega with me, the Biscuit Boy. So, last episode, not only did I pronounce the, <laughs> the name of this series wrong <laughs> in the first sentence, but uh, also um, we, we messed up the most simple thing you can do in Minecraft. It was making a cobblestone generator and I fluffed it. So yeah. Oh, there's a skelly over there. So yeah, today I am not going to be fluffing it. I'm going to be, I'm just going to be awesome. Okay. It's going to be absolutely top quality entertainment. So the plan is to explore many more of these different little islands. As you have may seen from the intro, there is absolutely loads and loads and loads. Like for instance over there, it looks like there's a lava island over there as well. So we're gonna check them all out. There's loads of different stuff to do. We've also got this side quest of pretty much getting every single color um, from different chests and stuff like that. So yeah, we're gonna, it is a survival series as well. So I do need to get the basics down. I do need to like, you know, collect some wood and all that stuff like that. So that is the plan for at the moment. I'm just gonna kind of be a good little, uh, good little survivalist. I'm just gonna collect everything that I need to. I know I need to get myself some decent tools and everything else like that. But we've got loads of different islands and stuff to explore, which is always good. Um, I do actually need to do a little bit of naming today because last episode we discovered a villager in the melon. Well, it's not even the melon place. It's the the big old wheat uh, block. Oh my god, am I gonna get pinged going for this? Maybe. Okay, I need to make a picker. Okay, so we have got a villager. We had a villager. Oh my god, we need to save this villager. Uh, save him. Don't. We need to. Save, I'm, I'm trying to save you here. Oh, this is dangerous for a villager. Dudes, I'm trying to. I'm trying to save you here. We haven't even named you. I don't want to be killing you off. Is he free? He's free. Oh my god. That was it. That was the most stressful minute of my life. It wasn't even a minute. It was like 10 seconds. Anyway, so yeah, I was like, name the villager. As for original ideas. Oh my god, I can hear a skelly. As, as for some original ideas, and people are like, why don't you call it Fred? That's not really original. Anyway, the original idea I'm going to go with is we're going to call him Chuck, okay? Because Chuck is a name that I love. You might have seen the name Chuck before in different series, but we're going to call him Chuck, okay? So Chuck's going to be, we're going to be good friends, me and Chuck. I need to get you a name tag so we can actually officially name you. But for the moment, you're just going to be called Chuck, okay? So dead is going to be your name, right? I'm going to steal this, not steal it, borrow it. I don't even know why I'm saying I'm stealing it. It's fine, I can take it. Um, so yeah, ooh, there's plenty of food in there, so I don't need to worry about food too much. I've got all these lovely melons and stuff and pumpkin seeds. Ooh, we can plant some pumpkin seeds. We can do that in here, I presume. Right, Chuck, if you've got a death sentence or something, like a death wish even, what are you doing? You can swim out there. You're fine, you're fine. You've got this, you've got this. Uh, right, melon, 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 melon. Right. Melons are difficult to grow, so I need to get rid of this. Have we got any more random pieces of dirt? We have. Okay, so I'm just going to get rid of this piece of wood. And we're going to trade you up for a lovely piece of dirt. We can pop down there. And then if we do it, it's going to grow which which way we want it to grow. Melon seeds. Oh, have I got pumpkin? I've got pumpkin. Beetroot seeds. Ugh. Nobody wants that. Right, so get rid of you. Get rid of you then you can grow anywhere around here so we're gonna leave you be for a second uh, and we need to work out which island we're gonna go to today so I don't know we need to get some of these saplings as well I need to make everything a little bit bigger so we need to use cobblestone slabs for that so the the cave cake last time didn't go so well it wasn't as delicious as I thought it was gonna be there wasn't much in there we have got downstairs which I really might want to actually make some kind of way down there and a crafting table would also be helpful too. It seems really weird, like planting trees on top of a bed. Like, imagine if you did that in real life. You're like, parents are like, what are you doing? Like, oh, I'm planting a tree. Where are you going to plant it? 
on top of a bed where I sleep. It's a little weird, okay? It's a little weird at far, but it is a survival map, so we're gonna we're gonna pop that there, right? Tree situation. I think that's gonna be good, right? Where do we want to go today? Maybe the crafting table we could go to. Oh, the furnace does look good, but it's got a heck of a lot of mobs on it. Maybe if we go from round the cake to... Oh, maybe we just go straight across. I've got plenty of cobble over here. Maybe we should just do that. I really want to see what's on this side before we go all the way over there. Because there's plenty of different islands and stuff like that. Right, so let's just kind of put everything away that I'm not going to need in the immediate future. Got some food. That's handy. Um... Bucket of water. We need a bucket of lava. That's what we really need. Torches. Good. Right. Okay. So we're going to get some cobblestone slabs. Because it is the cheapest way to get across. I've just used all of my cobblestone for that. Tom, please say I left some. Yes, I did. Oh, my goodness. I'm not a complete idiot. Right. We need to make a cobblestone generator, which I should have done. But I'm hoping there is going to be... Maybe it would be a lot easier just to go around... On here I think this might be a bit of a, a better way than just going straight across okay I'm gonna make this a double path because I'm always worried about falling off okay sun's coming up it's gonna help us <laughs> it's worst doing everything in nighttime absolutely the worst okay it's not where I wanted to I can have a skelly creeping if he knocks me off it is game over Oh, I'm nervous. I can hear him. He's bopping around up there. He is bopping around. Okay, Tom, you're good. You're fine. You've got no armor. You've got a you've got a zombie head on, for goodness sake. It's perfect camouflage. Okay, we're going to sneak attack. Okay, we're going to sneak attack this furnace. I can hear. I can hear Chuck down there. get me skelly oh my god how am i gonna get to all these blocks down there oh, man, there's a bedrock one as well oh i can hear mobs i can hear a lot of mobs in this one dude really just go to the top where i want you to go all right it's gonna be a heck of a lot Who's a chest? And pigs! Oh, awesome! Oh, we got some purple dye as well. That's gonna come in handy. Right, we're gonna go and pop this back. So we don't wanna die and lose all this good stuff. Okay, so this is purple. So we can do this for adding to the end result on the quest situation over here. Um okay, so purple should be pretty early on. Magenta, pink, blue. Is this supposed to be white? Get some wool, orange, nothing stopping you from taking wool, but... Okay, so we've got purple. Where's purple? Purple, yes, there is stuff inside usually. Right. Okay, so we've got a purple stained glass. Okay, we're going to put this in a chest. I want to do all, all pieces of wool. I think that'd be pretty cool to do. We've got a block of quartz as well, which is awesome. Right. So being over there... Let's armor up, because it's going to be a little bit hairy in there, I imagine. So we need to get some torches too. Right, let's do this. Let's see what's inside. <laughs> let's see what's inside the furnace. Whoa. Oh, risking it a little bit there. I'm going to add all this as well. And this is kind of like a little bit of boring detail that I need to do, but this is just for my own security. Because last thing I want to be doing is running up here going, Hey guys, check out this new island and just fall off. Do you know what I mean? I want to have it nice and secure just in case. Okay. Playing it safe. There's nothing wrong with that. I know my catchphrase is risk it for a biscuit. But, you know, it's the only second episode. <laughs> right. You can hear that skelly. Ooh, piggy. Don't you, don't you escape. You can go to my island. Right. Should I be really securing you, piggies? I think maybe I should secure in you so you can't escape. Right. What is down here? Is that a coal block? It is. 
And there come the mobs. Ooh, got pigs down here too? Oh, this is awesome. Okay. What is... Is there anything else down here or is it just literally this it? We've got pigs and stuff. This is the randomest map I have ever played in my life. I think that's it. Is that it for the furnace? Yep, that's it for the furnace. Okay, we've got a block of coal as well. Right. <laughs> okay, super weird. Super weird. I can hear, I can hear, I can hear skellies everywhere, but I can't see them. Don't know how these pigs are just like, all these pigs just dropping through the hole I've just made. I hope not. So I was wanting to keep these pigs and maybe breed them. And, ooh, don't push you off, piggy. Let's not push you off. All right. I need to get back out of here. All right, let's use, let's use these blocks because I don't want to use them. I want to actually find like, the proper stuff. Okay, I feel like I've entered the second part. Oh! Okay. I don't know how I did it, but I managed to dig right through the wrong bit, and now I found the right bit. This is where all the mobs be hiding. They're attacking each other, so that's going to help me. Get away, Zumble. Ow. Ow. Gotcha. You did. Woo. Holy moly. There is a lot. Come on. Is that it in here? I thought there'd be some something else. Is this it? I thought it'd be like some secret kind of like chest or something else in here so that just brings you back to this level okay this makes a bit more sense because i was thinking how actually big is this block and how much space we've actually gone into okay okay so we we, we didn't really get anything good from here <laughs> um it's slightly disappointing but it's fine it's fine the next island is gonna be awesome hopefully <laughs> how do i get out of here Oh, is a creep. Hello. Maybe I've spoke too soon, everybody. There seems to be some friends up here. I've got all this never walk block stuff. Let's just uh, use that and see what's... Oh, the pigs are down here as well now. I swear we're going to get blown up by another creeper again like last episode. Or is it just a one little lonely zombie? I don't know why I'm using a pickaxe on you, buddy, but it's the best I got. All right, let's see what's on top of the uh, on top of the furnace. Ooh, that's what's on top of the furnace. Right. <laughs> oh, why does this always happen? Oh my god! Right. This stuff is hard to mine as well. I thought this would be quite easy. Right, we're okay. <laughs> we just had a little creeper. I didn't do my manly scream like last time, but it's fine. It's fine. It's okay. Everything's all spectacular. What happened then? I thought it just like wouldn't let me mine up. Okay, just watch out for the creeper, Tom. You'll be fine. You practice this. All the pigs are down here now. Ow. I need to stop doing that. I need to stop dropping down here. I'm ready. Oh, there's two of you. Okay, yeah, it's made a little bit of a mess. The pigs are still good. I am wrecking these blocks. <laughs> I'm absolutely wrecking them. Is there anything up here? After all of this, there is not. Oh, I've got a tree grown. There is nothing up here, okay? After all that work, there is no secret chest or anything else like that. Oh my god, I really wanted to go and check out one of those low like, islands and stuff like that, but. Okay, goodbye pigs. I will see you soon. I know you're going to be here, so. Now, I don't want to use that block of coal. I want to save you. Right, okay. We have checked out the furnace. How the heck are we going to check all these ones down below? 
Like, seriously. How are we supposed to get to them? This is going to be a mission in itself, trying to work out how to get to all these islands in one place. Okay, I think the most logical place to go next is a crafting table. Have we got enough blocks to get there? Is the question. Man, it'd be so good if I could just use an elytra or something and fly straight down there. Okay, cobblestone generator. I really needed one. <laughs> I really needed one. I'm just hoping that I'm randomly going to find like a... A lava block or something. Anyway, let's try and see how far we can get across here. Um, oh my goodness. So many islands. I just can't get over it. I'm, it's so good that there really are so many though. I just want to check out. I just want to go to all of them now. Okay, but I know I can't do that. Alright, let's see what's behind door number two. What is in here? Hoping for some good stuff. Hoping for some... Oh, that's, that's a troll. That is a troll. Look at that. Look at that. We've got a chest on the roof. All right, we're going to have to do that then. Oh, I don't think I'm going to have enough blocks for any of this stuff. Um, okay, we've got wood coming in. Okay, this is not a huge waste by me doing this. It is a little. Wait a minute. If I turn these into... Can I just not turn these directly into planks? Do I have to get a crafting table for this? Okay, I'm going to make some some wooden planks. I want to see. I'm, I just want to know what is in, in that chest up there. Okay, so we've got 24. That's got to be enough to get up there. Now, I have learned from my other series, Sky Trade, that you need to put torches down. Okay, because otherwise it's just going to end up real bad. You're going to end up spawning everything in look at these stairs look at these stairs boys these are some dodgy stairs right now oh my there's so many islands i love it okay now all i gotta do is work out where the chest is it's there okay what is in this chest Tom, of all the things you had to do right then, placing a half stone, a half slab on it was not one of them. Okay. Oh, baby. We have got an enchanted apple, a normal apple. Oh, that is awesome. Yes, that was totally worth a trip. That was totally worth a trip. Look at that. Okay, is there anything at the bottom? Okay, this is, that, this is a good little island to go to, okay? A really good little island to go to. Right. Okay. We're getting through this. We're getting through this. That, that is a, it's a nice little troll. I like it. I like it. Right. Next, what we're going to do. I feel like we're flying through these islands, but at the same time, we are surviving, which is good. I'm going to put these away. Okay, that is so good. I'm super happy with that. Um, Let's get this one chopped down. I did make an axe, right? I'm sure I did. There we go. Okay, and I feel like I need to do something more with these melons. Well, this is good. At least we're going to get some more wood out of this. Hopefully, we're going to get some more saplings too. Have I got any more in my chest? I have got three there. Right, we should be really planting for more of these the better because we're going to get more sources of wood to get across. I imagine if we'd made a cobblestone generator, then we'd have been using that as our main source of getting across the islands as opposed to the wood. But, you know, I messed up, so <laughs> that's what we got to do. All right, maybe another one here. Uh, have I got any dirt left? I've got to have some dirt left. Six. Now, I need to save some of this because dirt's a precious commodity. We are going to need some for growing crops, but I suppose we have got chuck in the house we can rely on as well right next one we're gonna need is we're gonna need a bucket of water now this is gonna get really dangerous okay because we're gonna have to get across or down should i say and then getting down is probably not the hardest part it's gonna be getting back up too and um, i really need to make more of a safer way for getting up and down here but you know this is the way we're gonna go um okay some more torches right now i've just got to work out 
Got to work out how far this goes down. I'm getting a bit nervous about this, to be honest. So I definitely don't want to mess this up. Ooh, a bit of mining. Feels like we're in a cave. Okay. Tom, why did you just do that there? Ooh, getting nervous. Okay, get rid of that as well. I know I'm using a I know I'm using a pickaxe. I know, I know, I know. Right. Oh, it's gonna be down here. This map's awesome. I do love this map. Man, this is a this is a bigger one than I thought. I didn't realise it was all this down here. Okay, we're gonna be getting close. Alright, okay, let's try and work out in relation to where the nearest island is. I thought there was one closer. Maybe we've gone a bit far. Maybe we need a staircase a little bit more. I can hear a villager as well, which is really weird because I didn't think there was one in here. Have I got any torches? No. This is weird. I like it because I've got like a little cave under my uh, under my base. It's even weird if I can hear a villager. Have I got a secret room down here I didn't even know anything about? This is weird. Why? I can hear a villager. Is there a secret room? This is this is this is so weird. I need I need another torch as well. Where is this villager? Right, okay. Okay, so it looks like this one is probably going to be our best shout for getting down there with the water. We need to explore this bed properly and, and try and work out. Because if there is another villager, then... Right, I think that's probably going to be our best shot. But guys, unfortunately, unfortunately, I think we have run out of time for today's episode of abstraction mega i hope you've enjoyed watching i really need to explore this couple levels here because i'm pretty sure there's a villager hiding somewhere but i can't find him if you did enjoy today's episode make sure to give a like make sure you tune in for the next episode because we're actually gonna drop down here and try and explore some of these islands on the bottom and see what they have to uncover there are loads and loads as you can see there but big thank you for watching today i hope you enjoyed if you have make sure to give a like thank you very much for watching and i'll see you all in the next episode bye